First at six, saving a life in the line of duty. You know, it wasn't a car crash or some other bad accident, but the actions of two Romeo police officers who saved a man on the brink of tragedy. Seven Action News reporter Kimberly Craig talked to the officers and joins us live from Romeo with the very latest on this. Kim. Yes, Dave and Carolyn, the run came into dispatch here at 640 yesterday evening, and it's how these two officers handled it that saved a man from himself. They stated that he was in the business, but then they don't know if he went out the back. And at that point, another employee stated that they saw him enter the wood lines. Apparently believing he just didn't want to go on, the 56-year-old man had walked into the woods. Romeo police officers Richard Solier and James Daves were working the afternoon shift and responded to keep the man from harming himself or anyone else. We asked him if he had any weapons. He said he had two knives. We were trying to talk to him and, and try to find out what was you know, going on with his life, you know, what, what brought him to this point. And he didn't want our help, you know, didn't appear to want to harm us. We just wanted to be left alone. The man then began to harm himself. Dispatch made sure an ambulance was nearby. The man then walked across the water and then slowed down enough for Dave's and Solier to really make that connection. He was tired. His adrenaline had, had kind of dumped on him. And so we that's the point we talked to him for about 10 minutes and were able to convince him to come back across the water and, and go with us uh, to the hospital. The officers committed to helping this man now credited with saving his life. We helped keep the community safe and so it's a, it's, it's a good day when you can help somebody. What they did, they handled it in a friendly manner, a compassionate manner. They weren't, you know, forceful with the gentleman or, or anything like that. And, you know, that eases the tensions and, and makes it a little easier for people to come down from where they're at. And eventually, over time, they start to realize that, you know, Absolutely. things can be changed. Things aren't that bad. And the 56-year-old man is recovering physically and hopefully seeing hope in a new day. Reporting live in Romeo, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. And once again, we thank those officers for their heroic deeds in that regard. Taking the time to save a life. Now, if you or someone you know is struggling, the Suicide Prevention Lifeline is available 24 hours a day, every day. The number is right there on your screen, 1-800-273-8255.